All right, I am not sure what happened to this video. So um, what we will talk about or information that I will give is about gifts for the holidays for someone who you know is in a wheelchair or um, uh, a family member who's in a wheelchair or a neighbor or whatever, and you can't think of anything to give them. Uh, this is a list for the holidays so you can nail it. <laughs> Get them something that they would really need or appreciate. So here we go. It can be as simple as uh, a gift card to Amazon. It can be, you know, uh, a gift card to something else. So to a restaurant they like a lot or to an ice cream place they like a lot. <laughs> Or, you know, if they use a particular van in the county, you can gift them with some tickets for the van. You know, that would be awesome. Um, so, uh, or to something for the bus, you know, if they take the bus a lot, you know, a gift card for using the bus. Uh, so it's, it's all of those things that, you know, it seems like a small thing, but it really makes life so much better. So, and so much happier. <laughs> so, and someone was paying attention to the person in the wheelchair. So that's, that's always awesome. And people tell me, I don't know what to give you. You know, it's like, oh, gift card to Amazon would be just great. <laughs> so, <laughs> so um, think of that, you know, a gift card or tickets for something, you know, a uh, gift card for a, for a small trip, you know, going to stay in a cabin or or to go fishing with buddies or something. Uh, you know, gift card to, to, to your grocery store to be able to pick up, you know, things for sandwiches and stuff to go on a trip. Uh, it's, it's just those simple things. It doesn't have to be complicated. Uh, we, we love a lot of things that other people love too, so here is another great gift. This is a um, magnet. This, this thing is a magnet, and it is capable of picking up 20 pounds. So it is a rod, of course, that telescopes. I used it this morning because a member had lost her keys. She wasn't sure where, and we figured that it was somewhere out in the parking lot. So this morning, early, and it was... 30 some degrees out there, <laughs> not warm. I put on my snow uh, jacket, my winter jacket, and I went out there with my uh, magnet and I poked around in the grass. I, I looked down the special flashlight down the manhole, <laughs> any uh, nooks and crannies. I used my little magnet, uh, so I went all over looking for her keys. Uh, so this is incredibly useful uh, for a um, wheelchair uh, user because they can pick up, you know, things that are metal on the floor and possibly heavy. So this is, it has a capacity of 20 pounds and there are magnets that are even heavier and have a higher capacity than this one. But, uh, and this one was cheap. Um, I want to say 15 bucks. Uh, on Amazon. So uh, it, it's really useful uh, for heavier things because the Reacher, which is this one, sometimes when objects are heavy, you, you can't pick them up. So you need something, if they're metal, then you can pick up, you know, something like this. Uh, if they want to start a hobby in uh, metal detecting, then that's a different equipment. <laughs> so, but uh, this is awesome. It, you know, it turns really small, and it's easy to carry. Uh, so 20 pounds. And uh, I would say that that is awesome if you drop your keys or you can't find your keys or, you know, you're looking for something metal that you dropped. Uh, then that um, magnet uh, rod can, can really, really be helpful. Once I did the weirdest thing on my wheelchair, I was <coughs> trying to fix one of the arms of the wheelchair, and I wanted to tighten it or adjust it. can't remember what I was doing, but 
the it was an odd coincidence that I got the I got the nut out and the bolt I got it out and I was fooling around trying to put it in the right direction and I dropped it down the um the tubing of the power wheelchair it just went ding ding plunk <laughs> it's like oh no how am I gonna get that out so my arm I had to take off the arm completely and because inside the the arm uh pipe there uh it it was the, the bolt was in there and I didn't have another bolt so <laughs> I had to wait for a tech person to come in with one of those magnets to get my <laughs> to get the bolt out to put the arm back on it, it's such a ridiculous situation but <laughs> you never know when you're going to need something um, uh, a magnet to pick up something you dropped in the weirdest place so you know flashlights and and magnets are a huge gift <laughs> so <laughs> <laughs> the tech said to me when he got here, you did what? <laughs> what were you doing that for? <laughs> so <laughs> I just wanted to fix it by myself. <laughs> said, call me next time. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it just went down the, the tube of the power wheelchair and that was it. So you never know what's going to be like a huge gift. <laughs> and, you know, sometimes when you drop your keys outside and, uh, you know. So anyway, it's, it's sometimes the smaller things that are really a huge gift. And other little things that you can get that always wear out are, especially for manual wheelchair users, these gloves are always in need. So they're rubberized on one side and um, soft on the other. So these are, you know, cut off finger type um, gloves. So those are always in need. Then uh, for any one of us for power wheelchair or manual wheelchair users are these gloves for winter. So um, those are always in need. So they wear out after a while. So soft on one side and there's uh, rubberized on the other so these are always these are always great so um, gloves then I have a little gadget here that you know they might already have one from the hospital uh, but I use this one a lot you know this one is good for zippers or buttons you know that they might have trouble with and then this one I always use for, well, you can use it to put your, hang your clothes up or also to, I pick up my shoes with these <laughs> so, so I don't have to bend over. Uh, that's painful. So, uh, so this one I use for shoes or hanging up, you know, clothes. So these hooks are always, always useful. So if they don't have an Alexa, then, then that would be an, a, an excellent gift because uh, they can use the calendar, they can use all kinds of things, other gadgets they can add later. So that would be awesome. Um, can't think of anything, you know, if they don't have a very good laptop, you know, if you want to go a little bit more expensive, <laughs> a laptop is always a great thing. Uh, and never goes to waste. Um, if they have any other hobby, you know, you can uh, add a little bit into their hobby uh, for, you know, whether it's basketball or chess or doing puzzles or, you know, any of those kind of things help a lot. Um, these cups are really useful. So it keeps things cold and hot. So you have to check and see what kind of model you have. Uh, but I use this all the time. Uh, it's kind of metal. So um, if I drop it, it doesn't break. <laughs> so I've had others that I really liked, but I dropped them and, and I broke them. So these metal ones are, are really great. So it keeps your coffee hot or your uh, keeps your water cold. So whatever. This is a, I don't know, 20... 20 cc's 
Uh, so there are other ones that are bigger that are 40 cc. So those are pretty big. Cup holders for their power wheelchair, or manual wheelchair, but you have to know you have to know what kind, what type, what design, uh, what they need. So that gets a little tricky. But um, you know, a new pillow, uh, a new blanket for their bed. Uh, you know, it's it's just those basic things that they might not be able to afford. You know, as a family. You could do a gift of uh, a lock for the door that opens and closes automatically and talks to Alexa or Siri. So, you know, if they have Siri already, you know, you can add a piece, you know, that would be helpful for them. A doorbell or a, uh, yeah, a doorbell would be very uh, helpful that talks with Alexa or talks to Siri. So, uh, it's it's those things that just make life a little bit easier and helpful. Uh, you know, something for the kitchen that they've talked about that they don't have. <laughs> so it's all those kind of things that are just make life a little bit easier. So I have spent a lot of time patching up this video. I have no idea what happened to the sound. So <laughs> But what I wanted to say at the end was, if you have any questions, if you need more ideas, just let us know, and we'll put out, you know, a bunch of more ideas for you for the holidays for your loved one. So, uh, and if you all want to share, you know, what was a great gift for you in past holidays, feel free to post it. All right, folks, if you want to give me a, a gift for the holidays. <laughs> It can be a subscription, to subscribe, to like, to comment, and to share this video far and wide. All right. Take care. Stay safe. And I'll see you in the next one.